Hello, before this video starts, just want to quickly say that if you're planning on watching this video's visuals, it is just gameplay like the previous few videos, but this time it's gameplay of Hollow Knight, and it has some really big spoilers in it, so if you're still planning on playing that game and you just haven't gotten around to it yet, and you don't want to be spoiled for anything, then stop, or well, you can either stop watching the video entirely or just listen to it, because it's, it's all audio, there's no visuals, it's just me talking again, so yeah, uh, hope you enjoy. Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Nate Talks. I'm going to quickly apologize for my voice because I am somewhat sick at the moment. It's nothing to be concerned about, it's just like a stuffy nose, you know. So, today I'm going to be talking about quite a few things. I'm going to be talking about my old videos, which, all of them, basically all of them up to, I'm going to say up to the, probably Plants vs. Zombies, uh, all, including ones that are currently privated. Uh, I'm going to be talking about Kingdom Hearts, which I'm currently playing through right now, and I just want to talk about that. And then I'm going to be talking about uh, the future of gameplay content on this channel. There is a future. There's. It's not like I'm stopping it, but I'm going to be going in depth with it. So yeah, let's just get right into things. So the first thing I'm going to be talking about is m my videos on YouTube. I just want to talk about this because I just think it's something nice I can talk about. Uh, especially since a lot of them are currently privated. Let me move this out of my, my, the way of my screen. It was just a glass. So the first video that is current is public on my channel is called... Uh, it's playing very strange Mario Flash games. A video that was uploaded in... Hold on, let me look. May of 2020. So like six months ago. Yeah, like a, a little bit over six months ago. So, but the first video on my channel that you can't see because it's privated is called Diddy Kong Racing Conquer is the Best. So, this video was uploaded August 12th, 2016. At that time, I was 13 and I was about to turn, no, I was 12 and I was going to turn 13 in November so uh, that video I'm not gonna play it because it has it's very cringy and I there are three other people in it who I don't want to embarrass considering like, at least one of them still uploads occasionally so I'm not gonna say who I'm not gonna say who's in the video I'm not gonna say anything about it I'm just going to say that that video is a disaster, and I don't know why I haven't took it, taken it off the channel yet. But that video is a video of me and three of my friends playing Diddy Kong Racing on the Nintendo 64. And it is just a screaming about everything in that game. And I have not touched Diddy Kong Racing since. Originally, that was the most viewed video on my channel, despite it being private. It has 89 views. And it's not getting any more because nobody's going to watch it because it's privated. But then the shorts video I uploaded the other day overtook it by about 40, a little bit less than 40, like 30 something views. Uh, 33, I want to say. If I'm doing the math correctly. I think it has 122 right now, and this one has 89. So after that, uh, what's that? Like, not even six months, like. Seven months later, in March of 2017, I started a Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland Let's Play. Uh, this is about eight episodes long, and it is pretty disastrous. For the first few episodes, I believe the audio is okay, but after that, it just takes a dip and in quality and becomes... Like, one day I forgot to turn the, the game volume down, and you cannot, you can barely even hear me for like the last few episodes of it. It may have all been recorded in one day, but I'm not exactly sure. But, because I really don't remember it all that well. And then there, there's a stream that was no longer, on my, that's no longer on my channel at all because I deleted it. It was a VR chat stream and I deleted it because it's not good. Maybe one day I'll play VR chat with like a few of my friends or something. Because I think it could be fun, you know. Uh, maybe this week because it's like Thanksgiving and all. So I have a few days off. 
but yeah after that there's a mother three a two episode let's play of mother three uh that started <laughs> september 21st 2018 that was episode one's upload and episode two's upload was december 15th 2018 so and the between that the the kirby nightmare in dreamland video the, the final episode of kirby nightmare in dreamland was uploaded march 20th 2017 and all of those has have really considerable views, like 25, 10, 28, 10, 16, 16, 31, 36. Those, that's going in backwards order of episodes. That's the um, amount of views for each Kirby Nightmare and Dreamland episode. So those are considerable views for my channel, which was a bit smaller at the time. Like only I have 28 subs now. I had only like 25 back then. <laughs> uh yeah, and the Mother 3 episodes, episode 1 has 25 views, and episode, ele and episode 2 has 11, so. Then after that, of course, we have my first video as the Frosty Person. Those videos were uploaded when I went by Azumarill99, but now I go as the Frosty Person. So if you ever see someone with Azumarill99 as their username, it's probably me on a website where the username can't be changed. Uh, but don't always assume that. The only website that I think I'm still Azumarill99 on is Reddit where I'm actually using real 88, so... Because I think I made an old account or something, I don't remember. Uh... Yeah. After... That, yeah, of course there's Mario Flash Games, which was uploaded in May. That was a fun video. Uh, I think I got like 40 minutes of footage. There's not really many good edits, but... Still a pretty good video in my opinion. Then you got Hollow Knight NPC's tier list, which surprisingly has 20 views, but it's a very boring video. That video is a very, very boring video. Um, and I don't like it, so it's private now because I hate it. Uh, so yeah, let's keep going. The next video after that is me reacting to Pokemon Presents. I think that's a pretty funny video, strictly because my screaming reaction to the new Pokemon Snap. I'm going to play that, but I'll talk about that in, like, the gameplay videos section of this video. Then we go to Jack Bros. Jack Bros is a video that I was really proud of at the time of making it, but now I don't like it, because... So, in every video, in every review video after that, I had my brother uh, filming the live-action segments, because... But in the Jack Bros video, I filmed all the live action segments myself. Um with my phone just like propped up. I have like a pop socket or whatever, so it makes it easier. I actually have an eye ring. I'm a liar. Uh But yeah, so that video I don't like it all that much, especially since there's some really uh, some really bad audio issues, but I'm not going to private it just because it's still an okay video in my eyes, but it's not the one I'm most proud of. I think the one I'm most pr proud of might be FNAF 4 because I went through so much to make that. And by that, I mean, I'll get to that. Uh, then we got Five Nights at Freddy's. Uh, I like that video still. I think it's fine. Um, I no longer like the concept of the scary man. I personally think he's a bit of a weird character who shouldn't have been there. I think it should have just been Bup version 2 uh, giving me the game. And I was like, okay, I'll play that. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to speed through this because I've been going on for seven minutes now. Uh, Nintendo Direct Mini Reaction, that's a pretty funny video because you get to see me scream about Shin Megami Tensei. Final Fantasy Freddy's 2, another pretty good video, except I, it was definitely one of my more lazy videos because I didn't even get that far. I didn't beat everything. Uh, and then you got Five Nights at Freddy's 3, which is a video I actually beat everything for, so I'm very proud of that. Then you got Five Nights at Freddy's 4, where I went for a bit of a thumbnail difference in this one, having the thumbnail be Nightmare on, uh, trying to grab me, but I can't draw, so. Uh, then you have my Plants for Zombies video. A video that I still pr like a lot. I I do like this Plants vs. Zombies video a lot. I think it's one of my better videos. I think some of the jokes are pretty good as far as I remember. I think I might be wrong. Because uh, I don't really remember this video all too much like the rest. Uh, oh yeah, and I was going to elaborate on what I meant by Five Nights at Freddy's 4 was the video I'm most proud of. Uh, did I just say, I think I might have just said that Plants vs. Zombies is the video I'm most proud of. I lied. Uh, it's Five Nights at Freddy's 4. If I didn't say that, then I'm sorry. I'm r literally just kind of speaking off my head here, and I'm not remembering anything I say. If 
Five Nights at Freddy's 4 is a video that I'm happy with because beating Night 8 is one of the stupidest things I've ever decided to do, but it was something that I did, and I'm very pleased with it. So yeah, that's about it for all that. My current content doesn't get nearly as many views as my uh, different content, and I'm kind of upset about that. Or it's my older content, and I'm kind of upset about that, but, you know... This is what I enjoy doing compared to the old stuff. Because as much as I like making high quality content, it would ju the editing process on those older videos strained me way too much. So I can't, I can't really do it anymore. So yeah. Let's move on to the next topic. So our next topic is about Kingdom Hearts. And if you plan to play those and haven't already, then I'm going to put a spoiler warning here skip to whatever timestamp I throw on screen to uh, skip to the final segment of this video. So if you don't want to be spoiled, just go there. But uh, I'm playing the first Kingdom Hearts game at the moment. I got it. For, I got this collection for Christmas like a year ago. And for Christmas a, a year ago, yeah. And I still have not beat the first game because I'm lazy. But it's mainly because I got to the Tarzan level and then it was terrible. So I was like, you know, I don't really want to play this game anymore. And then I got to the Aladdin level, I beat that, and then I stopped playing. But uh, today I beat the Little Mermaid world, which was pretty good, uh, except for Ursula. No, actually the entire world was awful, because swimming, I didn't like the swimming. It was wonky, and you weren't fast until you got the mermaid kick, and it was dumb. And then the Ursula fight, the second one, was absolutely awful. Sometimes I feel like I died because of nothing. Like, I was swimming around, and then I just die, and I was like, why did I die? I beat her, though. It wasn't that bad, but it was still pretty bad. So at the moment, I'm, uh, I'm in the Nightmare Before Christmas world. And if you didn't know, Nightmare Before Christmas is my favorite movie, so I'm very happy about that this game has a world, has a world about it. Uh, so that's very cool. I'm very happy that there's a Nightmare Before Christmas world. Um... Aside from that, like, the combat... The combat's pretty good. I think I've been told it gets better in later games, but it's... I don't know. It's a bit boring, I guess. The button mashing is a bit weird, and the spells are kind of useful. I tend to use them a little bit, but they are kind of weird. Sometimes they don't hit when you're like, oh, that should have hit, but no, it didn't. Uh, I don't really even use the summons. They're weird. I'm probably really bad at this game, though. Uh, so if you, if I'm bad at this game, if you're a Kingdom Hearts pro and you know that I'm terrible at this game from what I'm saying, then go ahead and say it because I'm not going to deny it. <laughs> uh, despite my love of video games, I kind of suck at most of them. Except Hollow Knight. I, I beat every boss on Radiant in Hollow Knight, if you know what that means. So boom. I have proof. I'll put it up on screen right now. Uh... If I have the picture of it still, which I think I do. But anyway, um, that's about it. All I have to say for Kingdom Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't like the gummy, sh the gummy ship segments. They're boring. Uh, I don't really like the controls all that much. Uh, so, yeah. That's all I have to say about Kingdom Hearts. I'll probably do another update to that when I like beat it or something. But I just want to say that I am enjoying it so far. Uh... And I can't wait to get to Kingdom Hearts 2, because apparently that one's pretty good. So, yeah, let's move next topic. Uh, this final topic is about the current state of gameplay content on my channel. Now, I do have gameplay playing over these videos. I think I'm going to do Minecraft for this one. So if you're seeing Minecraft instead of Binding of Isaac, that's that's it. Because uh, I did Binding of Isaac for the last one, and then the cesspit of Storytime Animation Channels. Uh... God, that was that was a hard video to make because all the stuff was really hard to watch. It was such so clickbaity, but you know. Uh. Anyway, gameplay content. I don't know. It'll come back at some point. I will definitely be doing more gameplay stuff, making stupid videos of me commentating about a game. But at the moment, so if you follow me on Twitter, you've heard my struggles with this. So I got an. Elgato HD60 
Pro, I think. And I learned my computer did not have the PCIe slot to fit it unless I took out the video card's fan. So I did that. My computer's fine. Don't worry. I was called an idiot by my friend. The fan's reattached. My computer's working now, as you can tell. So you don't have to call... You can call me an idiot, but you don't have to because I've already been called an idiot. Um... So I sent that back, and instead I bought an Elgato HD60S. Now, <laughs> I was like, this is going to work. This is going to work. Only to find out that this thing requires a USB 3.0 connection, and for some ungodly reason, my computer only has USB 2.0 connections. So I'm just sitting there like... Mm. So I'm hoping to get parts to build a new computer for Christmas. And uh, I'm probably not going to transfer much stuff over from this computer. I'm really probably just going to transfer all the old video stuff. Uh, all like the files of the fully made videos and all that crud. So yeah, look forward to that I guess. when I'd say January probably is when it'll start again. Maybe. Uh, it all depends on when I get all the parts for the computer. Uh, right now I have none. <laughs> I might keep the power supply, but I need to look at how much it is, how much voltage it is, how much the wattage is, or whatever I'm trying to say. I need to look at the power supply to see if it supports everything, because I already picked everything out, all the whatever the power stuff is calculated but i just need to look at my own power supply to see if i can keep this one or if i need to buy a new one so yeah that's really about it for this um i might upload something that's not nate talks but i kind of just want to do these nate talks for a while because i think they're fun they're easy and honestly i do just like listen to myself talk even though I'm sick right now and my voice is dying and I'm dying. I'm kidding. It's just a stuffy nose. Uh, I think. But yeah. Uh, anyway. If you like this, uh, you can like and subscribe uh, and comment or whatever. If you do that, uh, if you do subscribe, turn on notifications because then you'll know when I put out more of this stuff. Uh, follow me on Twitter maybe. Uh, that's, that's really it. Uh, I do have a Twitch if you want to follow me on that, but I don't use it because streaming stresses me out. So, I would like to start streaming again at some point, but at the moment it's out of the question. So you could follow me on Twitch, but don't expect anything. Uh, I did accidentally stream at some point while getting footage, I think, for something. But... Uh, yeah, anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you all next time.